It is March 14th, 314, which means it's time to celebrate Pi Day. You sounded a little. <laughs> I know. I was, it, was it 314 or 314? <laughs> you get the idea. We're journalists, That's not right. mathematicians. They, uh, Some Chicago elementary school students did just that by flexing their math muscles. 20 seconds on the clock. He's driving me out of my mind. It may look like a dance party is about to kick off, but these kids have a lot more than music on their minds. We have an NCAA sports style math tournament going on where they're competing bracket style until they get one champion. Oh my God. And it is intense. They have 60 seconds to get as many division problems correct as they can. Scores from two rounds are added together. The winner moves on. Sweet 16! It started with students competing at their schools, and the top 64 show up here with their game faces on. The top 16 get a genius shirt. You can't purchase them. You have to win them. As the bracket continues to narrow, we're getting down to the last eight. Common sports themes emerge. Yes! The thrill of winning and the agony of defeat. Y'all right, got this. Students learn valuable lessons along the way. I was on top of my game. I practiced every single day. And it kind of, it kind of hurt. Final four. It's nothing wrong with losing, and it's nothing wrong with practicing. It's also nothing wrong with being disappointed that you lost. But you can't continue to beat yourself up over the past mistake you made. Sixth grader Samaya Tatum took home the top prize, a trophy for the school and her own medal. The competition was fierce. When me and her was going against each other, I didn't know how the score was going to be. But I'm glad our whole school was able to get first, second, and third. That's right. Wendell Smith Elementary garnered the top three spots. <laughs> but program coordinators say it's not just about today. We're building the future of our community, and uh, they're right here at the Genius League. I love that story. <laughs> their hands are moving so I fast. Know. I'm sure their parents are thinking now if you would only clean your room that quickly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> but how Not impressive. I couldn't even figure out the the questions that they were you know answering so right. quickly. 66 divided by, you know, 11 and all that things. But that would take me. <laughs> Those are some impressive students right <laughs> yeah, there. Yeah, I love They're all winners, I think. Yeah. Any Chicago school can participate. Go to 530scholars at gmail.com to request an information packet. Congrats to everyone mm -hmm. participating in that.